Hello, my dear students. I'm Dr. Prajna Mathyali from Government First Grade College, Dharwad, Karnataka. And my dear students, already I have discussed several points regarding the simple interest. I have solved many problems also, and I have explained you compound interest, and I have already shown you the calculation part. about the compound interest principles how to calculate the principal in compound interest how to calculate the rate of interest in case of compound interest and uh, while discussing the time period that is n we need the help of logarithm so now i have started to explain you about the logarithm also already i have explained you simple solutions of uh, logarithm and today in this video let us understand the left out part that is uh, some more aspects let us solve some more aspects of uh, logarithm and let us solve the problems also as far as uh, this uh, concern and let me show you the solutions of uh, some problems here using logarithm how to simplify it means how to solve the problems for example here what we are given with 0.045 into 18 that is 18.66 then divided by so this whole thing has to be divided by 0.25 into 2.33 here 2 numbers are to be multiplied separately then it should be divided so let us uh, solve it with the help of logarithm as it is asked here we have to go with logarithm of that is log of 0.045 then we have to apply the logarithm law law of logarithm first law of logarithm says you that log m into n here it becomes log m plus log n so here it will be log 0.045 plus log 18.66 okay and here also this is 0.25 means log 0.25 so here instead of multiplication we have to go with addition so log m into n is equal to log m plus log n so log 0.25 plus log 2.33 so this addition we have to make and then we have to go with the division for as far as division is concerned logarithm law says you that it should be minus that means log m divided by n is equal to log m minus log n so this is the log here i have shown you log 0.045 into 18.66 in a bracket and that is division log 0.25 into 2.33 here it becomes the plus addition so instead of uh, that is m into n we will go with m plus n so log 0.045 plus log 18.66 then instead of division it becomes minus and log 0.25 plus log 2.33 let us solve it how to solve it log 0.045 my dear students hope you know how to calculate the log first thing is to calculate the first part that is mentesa and characteristics first we have to think of how many digits are there before the point here it is 0 so 0 means it becomes minus 1 and after the point also there is one more 0 so here our answer gets minus 2 instead of 1 here it becomes 2 so the answer becomes a minus 
then we have to go for the log table we should refer the log table and we have to get the answer for 45 how to get it we have to refer the table 45 so next no digits so for zero column so i will show you the log table how it will be and uh, see this is the log table and here you have to refer the 45 and 0 column you should refer then you will get the answer so this is you will get the log table even in internet you can refer it whenever you want you can go with it if you want it permanently you can download it you can take the printouts also if you want uh, in physical paper so this is log table how it will be it will be having the columns and also main difference columns here our interest is to calculate the 45 we are referring the table for 45 in zero column so we are getting the answer for it and here it is 6532 if you refer the table you will get 6532 then our job is for log 18.66 here 18 18 1 8 there are two digits in a number 18 include two digits 1 and 8 so minus 1 we have to make so it becomes 1 so it becomes 1 point then we have to refer the table 18 for 18 we have to refer the table that is in the column of 6 we have to go here the digit is 18.66 so for 6 we have to refer the table in the table then what one more 6 is there for mean difference we have to see so the next part I will show you the calculation how it is made so this is the calculation how it is made how we have done and here as i have already told you 18 i have referred the table for 6 then main difference 6 again and we have added so we got 1.2709 is the answer as an answer we got it both of these two should be added now and in this column what we are having in this bracket that is log 0 0.25 means here it is 0 point therefore it becomes minus 1 that is 1 that is minus 1 we are having and we have to refer the 25th call the 25 for 25 you next net thing is there so 0 column we should refer that is 3979 therefore our answer is minus 1.3979 and here it is log 2 means only one digit so minus 1 means it becomes 0 point and refer here 2, 3, 23 and third column, column number 3. If you refer the table, log table, you will get 3, 6, 7, 4. Now our work is add these two, add these two and take the answer separately. And if you, while adding here, mind one thing, this 6, 5, 3, 2, it is after point, you know. And here also after 0.2709, you add only these two. You don't consider this first 1 and minus 2. Don't consider these two. First you add 6532 plus 2709. And you will get, see here, I will show you how we have calculated. That is 2.6532, 1.2709. These should be added. So we have to add these two. That is, while adding these two, 9, 2, that is 11, 1 and 1 extra, 3 plus 1, that is 4, 7 plus 5, that is 12, 2 and 1 more, carry 1, that is 6, 2 plus 1, that is 9. After adding this, you just think of these, minus 2 plus 1. So, minus 2 is greater, plus 1 is smaller. So, 2 minus 1 is the answer is 1. And 2 has got the greater digit has got the minus sign. So, it is minus 1. This is one addition. 
and in another part it is 1.3979 and 0.3674 add these two that is 9 plus 4 13 3 and carrying 1 7 7 plus 1 that is 15 5 carrying 1 9 plus 1 plus 6 that is 16 6 16 means 6 and carrying 1 3 3 plus 1 that is 7 and here it is minus 1 and 0 so it becomes minus 1 while add while adding you know minus 1 plus 0 means it is minus 1 only now come back here where we have left this one and uh, where we have the problem and how we have added you have observed this also and uh, what we have got the answers just you have observed now so we have got 1.9241 as the answer and here 1.7653 now in between there is g minus that is instead of divided by we have taken minus you know so it is minus here so we have to consider these two and also this minus so the calculation will lead us when you um, deduct these two and you will get the 0 0.1588 0 0.1588 we have got as a calculation so how we have calculated hope you know it see here 1.9241 we have to take okay it is also minus and again minus and minus that is minus 1.7653 so deduct here it is 1 so take 1 from there and it becomes 11 minus 3 that is 8 and you have given 1 so it is 3 now and take 1 from here then it becomes 13 minus 5 that is 8 and what is left out here out of 2 you have given 1 so 1 is left out take 1 from here then it became 11 11 minus 6 that is 5 and it is given uh, out of 9 1 is given to 2 so now 8 is left out 8 minus 7 that is 1 and minus 1 then minus minus 1 so it is 0 what is left out 0 0.1588 so this is the answer that is we have taken 0 0.1588 now we have to go with anti log see First you have to convert and you have to take log and at the end you have to take anti-log. This is putting the key and taking it out. Once you have put the keys you have to unlock it. Locking, unlocking. Log, anti-log. So at the end you have to go for anti-log without fail. So 0 0.1588 you have to go for anti-log. That is also table is available. Anti-log table is separate. You have to go for the anti log table and see here 0 0.1588. How to do it? You neglect the Mentesa part, what is there in before the point. You just neglect it and you go for this one, you know, 0 0.1588. 0 0.15, you search for 0 0.15. Eighth column, refer table for 0 0.15 in 8th column then what is this one more 8 it is for mean difference so for 8th column you will get 1438 okay then mean difference 8 that is 3 so you add it 1438 plus 3 that is 1441 after this 1441 this is the answer now and we have to put the points how to put it now you consider 0 point here it is 0 plus 1 means 1 after 1 digit whatever may be this 1 or 2 or 3 or 4 whatever it is we have to after 1 we have to put the point that is 1.441 is the answer. I hope you have understood how we have calculated it and let us go for another problem. Here using logarithm simplify square root of square root is given square root of 1.756. How to do it? What do you mean by the square root? Square root means that is 1 upon 2. Therefore, 
if it is square root we are taking 1 upon 2 if it is cube root we have to take 1 upon 3 if it is fourth root we have to take 1 upon 4 i hope you have understood how to take it then comes log 1.756 while finding the log for 1.756 first your job is what is there before the point that is 1 means only one digit is there minus 1 so it became 0 point now the answer will be that is see here log 1.756 refer log table we have to refer it and we will get it and see here for after this one you know we have to 0 point we have understood and now the work is for 1756 one seven means 17 for fifth column we have to refer the answer is if you refer the table you will get 2430 okay and then comes the final digit that is 6 for this we have to go for mean difference mean difference column 6 that is 15 is there so it should be added to 2430 okay 2430 plus 15 means 2445 this is the answer as i have already told you since it is 1.756 we have to take 0 point so the answer is 0 0.2445 and already we have got 1 upon 2 into log 1.756 now we have calculated log 1.756 here it is 1 upon 2 into 0 0.2445 and how to do it you know it 1 upon 2 means 0 0.2445 divided by 2 so it means 0 0.2445 divided by 2 so the answer is 0 0.1223 after getting this the work is not over you know just you have to go with the anti log this is anti log of 1 2 2 3 we have to make how to do it again see here point 1 2 2 3 means point 1 2 refer the anti log table point 1 2 that is 2 means second column and mean difference here that is mean difference 3 is there isn't it and if you refer the um, table you will get 1 3 2 4 and mean difference 1 so it is 1 3 2 5 and here see 0 point so plus 1 after one, 1 digit you have to put point so 1 3 2 4 means after one digit that is one point 1 point 3 2 5 is the final answer i hope you have understood how we have solved it and my dear students so this is the logarithm table and this is anti logarithm table so we have to refer these two tables for the answers so let us uh, go with a problem which is bit complicated and uh, here four five items are there we have to solve with patience and also with applying the same laws that is square root means we have to go for 1 upon 2 and where there is multiplication we have to go with addition and where there is division we have to go with minus that is we have to make use of minus so here read the problem first square root of 21.84 into square root of 0 0.0875 then it is divided and 1.0283 into 0 0.475 the whole thing raised to the power the whole thing is raised by 1 upon 5 so whole thing raised to the power of 1 by 5 so 1 upon 5 and how to do it how to solve it first let us simplify it how to simplify see here 21.84 we have to take the log for it you know then one more log we have to take that is since here it is multiplication sign log m into n is equal to log m plus log n so here log of square root of 21.84 
plus log of 0.0875. This is one thing. And instead of divided by, we have to go for minus. And what is there? Log 1.0 283 into 0.475 raised to the power of 1 upon 1 upon 5. So again you simplify it. That is more simplification. How square root you have to remove. For that it will be 1 upon 2 log 21.84. Again here square root you have to remove. So 1 upon 2 into log 0.0875. And minus sign is there. Again, what about the other part? Here, 1 upon 5 will come down. But both of these two should take combined. That is log 1.0283. Instead of my into, you have to take plus. Log m into n becomes log m plus log n. So log 1.0283 plus log 0.0. .0 Four seven five. This is the simplification. So, what is your job now? First, you take the first part of it. So, what is this? This is first you take log twenty one point eighty four. Okay. Then you go for log zero point zero eight seven five. Then you have to add this. You have to take half of it one by two and one by two of this. Then you have to add these two. This is one part. And again, you come here. For 1.0283 you take the log and also log 0.0475 add these two after adding you go for 1 upon 5 of it. Here you have to take the log and immediately you have to take 1 upon 2 and here also you have to take immediately then you have to add. After taking 1 by 2 here you have to add these two but in case of these you know after adding these two then as a common you are having 1 upon 5 okay so let us go for 21.84 log 21.84 here 21 means there are two digits minus 1 2 minus 1 becomes 1 so 21 the answer will be 1 point then refer the log table how that is 21 8 means for 21 you should refer column 8 then how about 4? It is for mean difference 4. Column 8 mean difference 4 for 21. So if you refer the table you will get 3393. 3. What you have done? You have referred the table. You got the answers. Then that is mean difference 4. You added and it became 1.3393. Then you take 1 upon 2 of it. That is you divide it by 2. And for here also 0, 0.0 that means as I have already told you there are two zeros means it becomes minus 2. And here 875 means you have to refer the table 87 for fifth column. Log table 87 for fifth column. Then you got 9420. So it is minus 2.9420. For this also you have to take into 1 by 2 means you should divide it by 2. And how about this 1.0283. Here 1 point means minus 1 means it is 0 point. And again what you have to refer 10283. For 10 you should refer the log table for column 2. That is 8 mean difference. Second column then 8th, 8th column for mean difference. Then the, the answer will, you will get the answer like this 0 0.0121. Okay, this is the answer. And again here we have got log 0 0.0475. Here also our answer is minus 2 point because here we are having 0, 0.0 that means minus 2. Point 47 fifth column we should refer in the table for 47 fifth column the answer is 6767 so what we have to do now see 1.3393 divided by 2 that is 0 0.6697 and here 
2.9420 divided by 2. So we got minus 1.4710. And for this we have added these two and then we divided by 2. So if we add these two, what you will get? That is 2.6888. We should add these two, you know. That is 0 0.6767 plus 0 0.0121. That is 6888. Then you think of minus 2 and 0. So the answer is minus 2 only. After this you will go for 1 by 2. That is divided by 2. And what you got here? 0 0.1407 minus 1 upon 5. See here why we are doing so. Just look here. I will tell you. I What I have done I will tell you. See 0 0.6697. Here it is minus 1.4710. Huh? This I have done here. And the answer I got. And what about this? First thing is 1 upon 5 you have to make. But here it is minus 2. Therefore, you cannot directly divide it by 5. So, it should be the 5 should go off. Then it should be multiplied by 5. You take that is 5 here. That is into 5. Let us do it. Let us take 5 here. That is add plus 5 then minus 5. There is no effect. I hope you got, got my point. See here, if you add plus 5 and minus 5, the answer will be 0. So, nothing happens. This equation, this number by adding plus 5, minus 5, the effect will be 0. But we need it just for the sake of getting cancel. We need 5 here to cancel it. Therefore, we are taking it. Okay. And how it happens? Plus 5, minus 5. Okay. And this plus 5, what will be the effect? Just see here, it gets cancelled, isn't it? It gets cancelled. So, our effect will be plus 5, it will be cancelled. And how, see here, minus 5, let us keep it like that only, okay? See here, here it is minus 5, let us keep it like that only. Let us, let us take this plus 5 with it. 5 minus 2.688. You just go with your simple calculator which is allowed for the examination. So, scientific calculators are not allowed in the examination. Go with your simple calculator. 5 minus 2.688. The answer is 5 minus 2 that is 3. So, 3.688. This is the answer. And here what is left out? Here that is minus 5 and mine here 1 upon 5. So next step that is 5 divided by 5. So minus 1 is left out. And it is, um, see here you have to deduct it and you have to take it. That is uh, 5 minus this one that is 7378 we will get. And... What is left out next? Next go with it. That is 0 0.1407 is like that only. We have not changed it. And here 1.07378. Here it is minus and here also it is minus. So it has become plus. Plus 1.7378. We have added these two. And the answer is 0 0.4029. Now we have to go for the anti-log, anti-log of 0 0.4029. For this, we have, while calculating the anti-log, we should go for the reference of anti-log table. That is 0 0.4 here, isn't it? 0 0.40, second column and 9 mean difference. For 0 0.40, second column 2523. And mean difference 9 means 5, add it. 2523 plus 5, 2528 and it is here 0 so plus 1 means after 1 place put the point. So in 2528 
if you put the point after one digit it becomes 2.528 so my dear friends i hope you have understood the solution of the problems how we have done it and i request you to go through the video once again and uh, as many numbers as you want you can refer the videos and it will be more clear for you even in my next videos i am going to solve many problems of logarithm i request you to give me the feedback for my that is lesson improvement and all and uh, please don't think that uh, the solution will be always difficult no uh, it becomes easy when you solve it for many number of times the same problem should be solved for many number of times and similar problems should be found out and they should be solved for many number of times so that it becomes practice and you will improve yourself thank you